everyone, this is Juan Cerullo, and now, happy Halloween for all of you all who, who love games, and for ha happy Halloween to all you trick-or-treaters, and just cool who I have with me, a little pumpkin. Nice to meet you, pumpkin, how are you doing? I'm doing good, happy Halloween! So, this game is mainly about Luigi winning a contest that he didn't enter, and he gets into a mansion, and he tries to meet Mario there, and Mario gets kidnapped into a portrait, and suddenly Luigi has to save Mario with the help of a professor who makes a, a little poltergeist machine that could take ghosts. And this was the very first GameCube game in both Japan and in the US. It was only for the GameCube, and it was the very first player's choice. And I mean, this game deserves a third a third sequel. The second one was for the Nintendo 3DS, Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon. I don't have a 3DS, but I'm going to review the second Luigi's Mansion game by the time I get a 3DS. So, the game is really good. It's too bad it's really small. I've played it. It was very difficult at first, but it's really fun. I mean, it's a good thing they use Luigi's Mansion for, you know... A little mini game in Mario Kart, Double Dash, and a little location for Super Smash Bros. Brawl. I mean, there's a lot of fun stuff that you can do in, in Luigi's Mansion. You get ghosts, you call for Mario continuously, um, save your progress, and you see Toad crying. You get to a, you get to the gallery with a professor, training area, you know, all that stuff. Luigi's Mansion should have a third game for either the Wii U or for the, the Nintendo 2DS. The Nintendo 2DS was released probably about a couple weeks ago, and of course, October 20th was the day when the Nintendo Wii was discontinued. I don't know why it got discontinued, but I'm pretty sure the very last game on the on the Wii was probably SpongeBob's Robot and um, Plankton's Robotic Revenge that I just mentioned on my PlayStation 2 and GameCube remote review, but I'm pretty sure our little pumpkin, the second um, inanimate object that we'll talk about it. How did you think of the game? I loved it. I can imagine if I was in that game chasing ghosts. Well, what would you think if you collected some of your own enemies? Like, what would you think they would be? Skeletons and zombies. Ooh, zombies, alright. So, you prefer zombies? Yes, zombies are so cool. They're better to chase than ghosts. Oh, I kind of agree. I mean, zombies are a lot more popular nowadays, all thanks to The Walking Dead and so many zombie movies. For those of you all who love zombie movies and TV shows like The Walking Dead, you should play this game and start liking ghosts and zombies together. Imagine if zombies were in the next Luigi's Mansion after the Dark Moon. It would be so cool if Luigi and Mario team up to save Daisy and Peach from zombies and ghosts. That would be so cool. And, and the disc? The disc is green. The only people you see is Luigi and Abu. And it's all green. Green, spooky green. Yep, and it's brand new. I got this at the flea market, I think yesterday, and it's very clean, and I've played it all night. And I've already been through, I've collected already three special ghosts. The first boss was a little baby. It was creepy sometimes, when you see Luigi screaming and jumping. He was like, yeah, like that. And if that was the pumpkin, he would go, ah! Ghost! A baby ghost! Would you really say that? Yes, I'm scared! Well, you don't have to be scared. I mean, at least you'll, you'll be more brave by the time if you actually were in a game. But I'm gonna have to wait a little bit. Well, alright. I'm pretty sure a pumpkin like you would ever be in the game. Would you ever play as Sleepy Hollow? Sleepy who? Sleepy Hollow, you know, have you ever heard of it? No, I haven't. It's a pretty good story. They made a Disney movie out of it. They made a movie with Johnny Depp and everything. They made continuous Sleepy Hollow movies. They made um, a TV series. Really? Yeah, and the guy had a pumpkin on his head. He's headless, and he had to use a pumpkin. Oh, okay. So anyway, Luigi's Mansion is a really good game, it's really fun, I think this game deserves to have a third game, they already made a second game for the Nintendo 3DS, and I'm pretty sure the third game in the future will be good. It'll be probably be called Luigi's Mansion 3, and I'm pretty sure Mario might be in the front cover this time, and I'm pretty sure this time they'll have to save their girlfriends Peach and Daisy. So, comment and subscribe, and I'll tell you which my next video will be, and I'm actually going to tell my video next video right now, and that's the games that should have been for the PlayStation 2. I was going to do the Luigi's Mansion Halloween review before the PlayStation 2 games that should have been on the PlayStation 2, so I did, so 
please comment, and subscribe, and please like. So, rock on, and happy Halloween. Hua ha ha ha!